take a look at this world. We see beauty. We see tall mountains that reaches the highest altitude. We see great bodies of water that covers the most unreached surface of the world. We can see the bodies that divided one mountain from one another. We can see man-made inventions that results of hard work and creativity. Above all, we see the most beautiful creations, people. Yet, with all this beauty, we can see great sadness. Past hatred, constant war, abundant evil, oppression, division, terrorism. And what is there to be thankful for? our family, we can be thankful for our health, we can be thankful for our education, we can be thankful for our employment. There is a lot to be thankful for. But how about those who don't have all these things? are there we can be thankful for and what about if all the things that you have today will be taken out from you what is there to be thankful for is our thankfulness is based on the things that we have on this earth or it is based on something much greater than ourselves. Something that you cannot lose when you die, but it's gain. Something eternal. Something that cannot be taken away from you because it goes forever. Our eternal life. That God crafted out of his love and goodness of his heart and brought it into a perfect eternal purpose. That you cannot compare the pain that we experience on these earthly bodies, nor much to the beauty that we see on this world. We can be thankful for the breath of life that make us a living beings. That we don't just have to walk in this surface of this planet aimlessly. But we have something to look forward for that we exist because we are need to experience over and over again the grace the love and the joy of our Creator Jesus Christ. We should be thankful for our eternal life. We should be thankful for our salvation and what is there yet to come. Let us be grateful for what we have. Happy Thanksgiving Day and God bless us all.